In just weeks, all eyes will be on the Space Coast as American astronauts launch back into space yet again. It's a mission that could draw historic crowds, but tonight NASA is telling people stay far away from Kennedy Space Center. In fact, stay at home. News 6's Eric Sandoval is in Brevard County tonight with the details. This area of Space View Park here in Titusville would normally be crowded with people watching any launch, let alone one that's sending American astronauts back into space. But with the threat of COVID-19, NASA is now sending out a warning on this launch. Stay home. We are very excited about launching commercial crew here May 27th. NASA Administrator Jim Bridenstine says there is a lot riding on May 27th's launch. Bob Bankin and Doug Hurley will become the first American astronauts to launch on an American rocket from American soil since the shuttle in 2011. But because of the coronavirus, Bridenstine says he doesn't want the crowds. We're asking people to stay at home, to watch from home. We want them engaged. We want them to participate. We want them to tell their friends and family but we also want them to watch from a place that's not the Kennedy Space Center. He says he doesn't want anyone getting sick, and it's an effort he's taken behind the scenes as well. He says work shifts for crews working on the Demo-2 mission have been staggered to keep them socially distant. The staff inside Mission Control on launch day will be separated, some in different rooms completely, some separated by plexiglass. And the astronauts, following standard protocol, Bob Bankin and Doug Hurley will be quarantined for the weeks before the launch. We're looking at all the things uh, where we can practice the guidelines uh, for social distancing and at the same time launch this very important mission to the International Space Station. Now this week, Space Coast Tourism officials said that a launch like this would normally draw hundreds of thousands of people to this area. They say they're going to be watching to see what the governor does, maybe lifting some of the travel restrictions. If not, they hope the national attention will help make the Space Coast some people's next vacation destination. We're in Titusville. Eric Sandoval getting results. News 6.